Welcome to the start of the gameplay premiere series of SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated right here on Yellow Nick. Alright, so let's get started. Alright, let's do this. Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the star of the Today is the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. If Bikini Bottom happens to get demolished in the process, oh well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicato Tron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command! One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one is Plankton a Genius. Answer yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! <laughs> Welcome, my perfectly obedient robot army. Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh, hey, hello? What do you think you're doing? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no, 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 wait, wait. But I'm your master. I made you. No, no. Horses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I think mine, Robo Junior, or Zorlon, or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you! <laughs> it's not just any shell, it's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick! So we put the toy robots in here. Okay! Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay! Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with! But Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did! <laughs> so, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama, Alabala, Wisna, Tiki Tana, Fushbark, Riddle, Bits, Von, Vita Schnauzer, but I keep forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? Sure! Last week I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry, so I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell. Then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning I had lots of little cookie crumbs! Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever! Good night, SpongeBob! Good night, Patrick! The next morning. Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with. Wow! Uh, Gary, did you do that? So oh, this is basically a remake uh, from the original game. So, well, 17 years. Yeah, Gary. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm going to have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Wow. What a fantastic idea. These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Press this button to read the signs. Hmm. Wow. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. All right. So we're going to explore the rest of SpongeBob's house. 
So, this is the start of the remake. Hmm. I make myself a snack, but there's no time! A note from Mr. Krabs! And it even smells sweaty, just like him. <laughs> Ahoy there, SpongeBob! As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been, er, promoted to head shiny object collector. Wow! A promotion! That's right! A promotion! So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Shiny objects. So uh, I've already done exploring the bathroom. Breaking news! Bikini Bottom residents have been attacked by a raging torrent of robot horror! So much for fixing this quietly. <laughs> Authorities are not sure who is responsible for unleashing the mechanical menaces, but they have assured us that the person is in big, big trouble! Uh-oh. Did I say big trouble? I meant so enormous that it's hard to comprehend trouble. We'll keep you posted as this tragic story unfolds. Tragically, we're sure. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. Hmm. Oh, there's a lot of uh, the photos of SpongeBob in the past uh, episodes. All my old comic books. Alright, and um. I love opening presents. So, this isn't quite. I quite this know from, I keep all my old from, comic books. from uh, the original game. All my old comic books. Right. Uh, wait, wait. Okay, gotta press B. Okay. All right. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Gotta press the Y. All right. Pressing B, but I but A is to jump. Right, I gotta hit the button. Lost socks. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. All right. <laughs> All right. So I've got the golden spatula. All right. All right. So let's go into Bikini Bottom. like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Red at Bikini Bottom. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. 
I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. <laughs> I love those spoons like they were my children. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bent all my forks? <laughs> Not the forks. Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas in your dreams. You've got a deal. <laughs> in your dreams. I love opening presents. SpongeBob, this slapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. No more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm going to help you out. And of course make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. Do you think I've got bilge water on the brain? I ain't running a charity here. Come back when you've got enough shiny objects to trade. relaxing mud bath this morning. And now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Half a guy were just playing a game and... Now I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. Ha! <laughs> ha! Move to another town. Ha! I crack me up. But seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. Okay, 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 just stop jumping, will you? If you take this golden spatula, will you please go away? See, Squidward, I knew that you could help me out. You're the best. Don't mm. oh, touch me. <laughs> <laughs> of course, no wonder why Squidward doesn't want to be bothered. <laughs> All right. We'll exit Squidward's house. Then we'll go to Patrick next. Hey, SpongeBob. Oh, I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Bubble buddy. You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. Right. Press this button, and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you. Try it out! Hey, 
Hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Oh, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. <laughs> you mean spatula? Bless you. <laughs> Another find for Patrick! <laughs> Alright, so we'll go on to Patrick's rock. Under a rock. Now oh, that's a life. Boy, Patrick will be glad to have this back. Of course, there's a photo of SpongeBob and Patrick. Alright, till next time, right here on Yellow Nick. <laughs>